In this video, I'd like to talk about how automation or technology can turn people into button pushers. Hi, I'm Nathan Moss, and welcome to Elephant Automation. In the manufacturing world, a button pusher is someone who manages a machine. They pull a part out of a box, put it in the machine, press a button and the machine cycles, they pull the part out and put it in another box where it heads to another operation. What has happened is that the machine does all the important work while the person just moves the parts around. I'm not a big fan of button pushing jobs. In the best case, they're a necessary evil where the cost of human labor is low enough and the cost of automation is high enough that they make economic sense. I'm a firm believer that humans are creative beings and that we need to spend at least a some part of our day being creative and doing creative things. In the office, where software is our automation rather than machines, we still end up doing a lot of the same patterns that we find on the manufacturing floor. In many cases, we are simply entering names and numbers into one software, press a button and it prints out a result that we copy and paste into a second software for storage. The interesting thing about the software world is that we can automate so much of what a person does during the day. Whereas in the mechanical world, it is very expensive to replace the touch and feel that a person has. With automation, you need to be conscious of what you're doing. Ideally, you'd prefer to automate everything that isn't creative or require human input, where you strip out all but what is essential for you to do. Just something to think about. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video and like more information like this, please feel free to subscribe to our newsletter. There's an opt-in link down below. Also, please feel free to comment, like, and share this video with anybody that you think would get some benefit out of it. Thanks for watching, have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video.